Hi everyone, this is Michael Stoltz with MichaelStoltz.com, changing the world one pixel at a time. So this video is going to be a little bit about uh, creating filters in your Gmail account. And um, it's, it comes in extremely handy when you have uh, you know, a lot of email coming in. You might have several newsletters, you might have important emails, you may have junk emails that you might want to read once a month. Uh, you may be managing a couple different uh, email addresses through your free Gmail account and you want to label those so you can you know, easily find things uh, when you can. Uh, or maybe you're getting spam and you're like, you know what, I've unsubscribed from these people and they just absolutely won't stop sending me email. So there's ways where you just, you know, filter that right into your junk box or delete it. You know, don't pass go, don't collect $200, that whole kind of thing. So. I want to just get started to show you a little bit. Uh, I've sent myself a few emails to this test email. Click over here in the upper right hand corner to the settings wheel, mail settings. Click on the filters tab. And obviously this is new so there's no filter set up but you want to select create a new filter. And I want to say any emails that come from mike at michaelsouls.com um, you could say any emails that come to you know info at abc.com uh, assuming that uh, you are managing some domains with your free account there's a certain subject line has certain words that contain whatever doesn't have this as you can tell there's a lot of different um, scenarios even if it just has an attachment so it's pretty cool so I'm gonna do a test search and we have these two right here that I just sent you wanna click on the next step and here's your options. You can say, check this box saying skip the inbox, archive it, mark as red, star it, uh, choose apply a label, which in this case, I'm going to say apply the label. Um, now these are the only ones that I have. Uh, bills, important info, Judy's newsletter, personal receipts, travel work. I'm going to say from Michael Stoltz is going to be my new label. And what I would like to do is mark it as red and that's it. Now some other options in here, you can forward it to another email address, you can delete it. I mean, it's pretty self-explanatory just reading these things. I'm going to apply um, this filter to the two previous conversations that are already in my inbox, and just basically hit create filter. Bam, so now that we see we have this one filter right here, you can go back and edit it at any time. So let's go back to our inbox real quick and voila we have that right there now probably what we want to do is um, change the color up on a little bit to, so it stands out and there you go so anytime that I send an email so to give you an example let me go over to my other screen here and just uh, send myself an email come back over here See if it goes. Well, now it's taking forever to uh, to get it, but ideally you get the point of what's going to take place here. Uh, this will come in extremely handy for people that want to get it organized, that's managing several domains, uh, you know, email addresses with one account, and uh, it will help free up the clutter. It'll help uh, visually. Um, give you some different room. So hopefully it's helpful. We'll talk to you soon.